Hello, hope you are doing good. In this video, I will be showing you how to change wallpaper on MacBook from Pinterest. The first thing you will need to do is go on to Pinterest.com and from there you can tap on the search bar at the top of the page and you can start searching for the type of wallpaper that you would like to add. So let's say for example I wanted to add a lion wallpaper. I could type in lion wallpaper then tap on enter and by the way, you can see right here that when it comes to Pinterest, you can see that their pictures have different dimension. But don't worry, I'll be showing you how to use any one of these pictures. Whether you'd like to use a portrait picture or you'd like to use a landscape picture like this one, I'll be showing you how to do that. So let's say, for example, this is one of the pictures that we'd like to use. All you'll need to do is select the pin, then tap on the three dots, then tap on download image. After you have downloaded that image, you can continue downloading more images. So for example, say I could download this image. So I could select this image, then tap on the three dots, then tap on download image once more. And you can select this image also, then tap on the three dots and tap on download image. After you have done that, you could scroll down and add more images. Once you are finished doing that, you are going to open a new tab and you're going to go on to canva.com. Canva.com is a platform that you can use for completely free to do different designs online. With this, you're going to tap on the search bar at the top and you're going to type in MacBook desktop wallpaper or you can select MacBook wallpaper. After you have done that, you can tap on see all and you can see that they provide us with numerous templates. But what we're going to do, you can select any one of the templates as long as it doesn't have a crown. You're going to select one of the templates, then tap on customize this template. And you're going to be redirected to a new page. On this new page, you're going to select the template, then you're going to tap on the trash can. After doing that, you're going to go over to the left hand menu option and you're going to tap on uploads, then you're going to select upload files. From here, you're going to select the pictures that you have downloaded, then you'll tap on open. Once the pictures have been added, so let's say for example, you would like to use this landscape pick. All you would need to do is drag and place the landscape pick right there. Then you'll tap on the three dots that says more. After you have done that, you can scroll down and you will tap on set image as background. And you can see it right there. So that is how it would look right there. And you could further edit the image if you want. So for example sake, you could select the image. After you have selected the image, for example, you could go over to edit right here. You could tap on edit. And then from there, if it is a case that you would like to add a filter, as you can see how it looks, you could go over to the left hand menu option and you could add a filter if you want, as you can see right there. And you can also add shadows and shades. Once you're finished, you'll tap on share in the top right hand corner, then tap on download, then you'll tap on download once more. And once it has been downloaded, all you'll need to do now, as you can see right here, it has been downloaded. You're going to go into settings. And after going into settings, you're going to go over to the left hand menu option and you're going to tap on wallpaper. Then you're going to tap on add photo and you're going to tap on choose. After you have tapped on choose, from there you can select the wallpaper that you have downloaded. So for example sake, remember the wallpaper that we had downloaded a while ago. So we're going to select that wallpaper real quick and you're going to tap on choose. After you have done that, if I were to minimize this, you can see that the wallpaper has changed. So you can see how it looks right there. And if you want to use the other type of pictures, you can do that. So, and if you want to use the other type of pictures, you can do that. So all we would need to do is go back. Then from here, we will remove this pic. So let's delete this image. Then go over to the left hand menu option. And from there, we are going to tap on uploads. And we are going to select the pictures. So you can see this picture right here. You could add the picture and you can also adjust the size of the pic by pulling along the end, as you can see right there. 
and you could add another picture so let's say this one then you can adjust the size again by simply pulling along the end right here and you could add another pick so let's say this one so we'll be adding three pictures so we'll adjust the size so let's do that real quick after you have done that and it is to your liking as you can see right here we are going to tap on share in the top right hand corner then tap on download then again you're going to tap on download once more now once it has been downloaded as you can see right there we're going to go back into settings and we're going to tap on add photo once more then from there you can tap on choose and we're going to choose the wallpaper that we have created so let's see it you can see it right there and we're going to tap on choose and with this one you'll see that it looks a lot better than the first one as you can see right there